that we've done for the uh, Four Seasons Farm up here in Quebec. Um, so I just want to show you a couple new features of this. Um, for one, it has a, fiber, a plexiglass lid. See this? This is to protect the operator from if he pans out of the basket as it's spinning. Again, it has just a right there, so you flip it up. We're using the orange baskets in here. So as you can see these, this is where you can buy four or five or six and they easily just drop right in. Um, again, it just has a regular timer on this. And uh, you can see we cut the top a little bit wider here and then put hose on it. So let me do a little close up and kind of show you some more of the advanced features. Okay, so let's go ahead and pull this basket out. And as you can see, we kind of changed how we're putting in the, uh, the, the brackets here to hold this, the basket in. We switched to using the PVC, saw someone do that online and um, just thought it would actually work out really nicely. So for this, we're just using half rounds of PVC, using a screw here and a screw at the bottom to hold it in place and just ended up cutting it just to fit right in there. Um, let's see what else. Oh, let's focus on how far we can zoom in. So if you notice right here where the uh, the it's attached to the plexiglass, we used an, actually an O-ring right here to go between the big fender washer to hold that in well. So just that actually, the reason for the uh, O-ring was to kind of give it a little bit of spring. We didn't want anyone, you know, slamming it or something to break the, the plexiglass there. So, okay, that's a new feature. And other than that, these blocks here are wood and because we weren't sure what thickness it would be, we didn't want to get the food grade material. So these will be taken out and replaced with a food grade um, plastic material at a later date. But other than that, that's kind of what we've got. Um, any more questions? Oh yeah, let's just go ahead and show you how it operates. I wanted to point out here that I redid the water. So this would normally go over to this pump right here, but I ended up taking this off, flipping it around so that it comes straight down and then out. So the water stays away from the motor and that sort of stuff. Here we did a second one for JM and he's gonna actually go ahead and get a custom piece of stainless steel fabricated for this. For, so it's gonna be like a little bit of a lip. So you can just drop this right in the middle. Um, but yeah, he's going to change the top compared to we had the, the lid over there. This is the same uh, switch. We just were lacking a plate today. So that's there. Uh, let's see what else. So yeah, same, really similar. Again, PVC. Just holding that there to hold that basket nice and tight in there. And again, you could use a trash can if you wanted instead and just adjust how the, the PVC was set there.